Adding a maker's mark is an essential way to show the world that the knife you made is uniquely yours. However, traditional ways like hot stamping and acid etching can be time consuming and require specialized equipment. Now, this is where lasers actually start to become extremely useful. Today, we're gonna to be talking about the Auto Laser Master 3 and how it could be useful for you as a knife maker. So who wants to play with lasers? So the laser I'm going to be showing today is an engraver and a cutter called Auto Laser 3. It's quite a powerful laser engraver and allows you to create, you know, detailed and precise marks on metal, on wood, Tidex and a variety of different other substrates. It has a 10 watt laser power and a laser spot size of 0.05 by 0.10 mil. So this means that you can achieve quite beautiful marks and actually quite permanent. So why do we choose laser? Number one is speed. With a speed of 20,000 millimeters per minute, it performs perfect work in less time. This means that you can mark the knives really quickly and move on to other things that you enjoy better, like hand sanding. Another advantage of the Auto Laser 3 is the depth of field. It has a cutting support of up to about 30 mil and an 8 mil depth of field. You can create marks that are not just beautiful looking but also functional for purpose. You know, one of the great things I love about lasers compared to other traditional methods is the precision. So when it comes to accuracy, this uh, auto laser free is, is quite difficult to beat. It has an accuracy of 0.01 millimeters. This means that using a laser can have advantages over traditional methods because you can have precise lines that a hot stamp or an acid edge may not be able to give you. One big stumbling block I've noticed with many lasers that I've seen and actually tested is that it's quite difficult to use. You need a special software, you need a lot of technical knowledge. The great thing about this particular laser is I was able to use uh, very easy to use software. I'm not just talking about light burn for PC and Mac. I was actually able to use it straight off the mobile phone. The app is called Laser Explorer. It's a free app. It makes it easy to engrave your photos into your blades, your blanks, or whatever it is you're trying to mark. This means you can actually add quite personal information quite easily just using the Laser Explorer app. Now, another thing that people don't pay much attention to when buying lasers is safety. But you'll be pleased to know that the Auto Laser 3 is designed with seven security features to ensure that you have a secure workflow. This gives you peace of mind when using the laser engraver and allows you to focus on making knives without worrying about accidents or fire. Now, the good thing about this laser is it allows you to connect to the machine in several different ways to process the information and obviously etch and or engrave. It includes either using the USB slot, uh, an SD card, Wi-Fi, and other several methods. This means that it makes it easy to transfer files and get to the stuff that you wanna do quite quickly. Last feature, but certainly not the least, is it has an automatic reminder feature. This feature ensures that your laser engraver stays in good condition, giving you the best possible results every time that you use it. So in summary, the Auto Laser 3 actually gives knife makers like you a fast, uh, an accurate, and a safe way of adding your maker's mark or engraving your maker's mark onto your blade. Obviously, it doesn't have the same features as a fiber laser, which is completely understandable for at this price point. But again, at this price point, it's actually quite good. It can do quite a lot of different things other than the maker's mark. Get a massive $105 off your purchase. Use code UKBLADESHOW105. That's a whopping $105 off. Link in the description below. If you have other suggestions on what a diode laser can be used, for knife making, please let me know in the comments because this is still new to me and I hope this video was actually quite useful to you guys. Thank you very much again for watching. If there's a specific tool or equipment for knife making that you want me to review, let me know in the comments. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video.